it says to the world the church is still <laughs> a player in the United States. Even the president in his remarks talking about the 70 million plus Catholics in the United States and the contribution of the Catholic community uh, in so many different facets of the life of our nation. And the Holy Father in a masterful address uh, was able to underscore a lot of Catholic social teaching. Uh, he began by pointing out the image of Moses right there in the Capitol, reminding us of our religious roots for our democratic institutions and talked about Moses as the lawgiver and the law having the function of protecting the dignity of people made in the image and likeness of God and uh, went on to talk about the need to work for the common good. The common good was a phrase that he used constantly and in a culture that is so highly individualistic as ours where it's me first, my rights and uh, for the Holy Father to underscore, no, you have to come together and form community and look for the common good that everybody shares in. And in a time of such great polarization in our world and in our church, uh, it's very helpful to hear this message calling people to step up to the plate to work together. And he underscored a number of very important issues. Uh, certainly the life issues for you know life from in all stages of development and then he went on to develop uh, further around the notion of a global abolition of cap capital punishment and uh, cited the the work of the, of the bishops conference here in the United States along those same lines uh, he also uh, talked about what politics is supposed to mean and also the role of the business world and uh, to create wealth but also to do that with part of their mission is to create jobs and to lift up people out of poverty and to uh, help people who are excluded to be able to find a path to be a part of the prosperity of the nation. Uh, he held up four wonderful uh, American figures, Abraham Lincoln, uh, Martin Luther King, Dorothy Day, and Thomas Merton, and used them as sort of models of different ways of uh, building a civilization of love. And uh, uh, it was a masterful address, and I think that uh, the response has been extremely positive, a great blessing for us.